Lucid Motors' first vehicles are scheduled to be delivered within the next five months. A lot needs to be organized before the company is ready. The charging infrastructure and network are one of them. Even though it may seem like the EV maker is spending a lot of money on research and development, they're going to save a lot of money, both in the long and short run. Most of the credit goes to the fast charging system it relies on. How does Lucid Motors save money on its fast charging network? And is it a reliable way in the long run? Welcome back to New Vehicle Media, your go-to channel for EV stock. Subscribing doesn't cost a thing, and liking will boost your personal YouTube homepage. Share your thoughts and let us feature your comments in future videos. EV Charging Infrastructure in North America According to the CEO of Lucid Motors, Peter Rawlinson, the EV maker and seller has found itself a second-mover advantage as compared to other companies like Tesla. By this, he means that Lucid Motors does not have to set up its network of charging stations like Tesla had to do. It was something necessary for Tesla as there were not many third-party charging station companies, and Tesla had to support its buyers with an extensive network of charging stations. This was done to eradicate range anxiety among early Tesla buyers and make them confident that they could easily travel across the country without fearing that their EV could run out of charge in the middle of nowhere. That was the year 2010, and now, for Lucid Motors, this is not the reality, and it can divert its focus and resources towards narrowing the charging time and expanding the range of its vehicles. This is actually what the company is busy doing. An immense amount of private and public investment has been coming in lately to cater to the growing number of electric vehicles being bought by customers. A few prominent names are Electrify America and ChargePoint. Out of the two, ChargePoint has a notable position due to its Level 2 charging stations network and how it's enlarging its network of DC fast chargers as well. Electrify America cannot be neglected or ignored as well. It has been announced very recently that the number of charging stations set up by the company will go up to 1,700 in the year 2025, and each charging location will have an average of five to six chargers to facilitate customers. Lucid Motors might not have a first mover's advantage as Tesla had back in the 2010s, but it sure does have a lot of advantage in the 2020s. The EV maker and seller is bound to vertically integrate itself when it comes to sales, manufacturing, and servicing, but does not have any plans to invest in building its fast charging network. It does seem like the best thing to do as there are many third-party charging station companies available presently. Next Generation Technology Peter Rawlinson has mentioned at many points that Lucid will be making good use of next-generation technology. By this, he is hinting towards the latest public charging networks and Lucid's Wonderbox technology. The public charging stations present today and set up by companies like Electrify America and ChargePoint are as capable as the superchargers set up by Tesla as their advanced form of EV chargers. On top of that, the Thunderbox bi-directional battery in the Lucid Air and its 900-volt system makes it capable of receiving as well as discharging power. It can get charged with both AC and DC power. From what Lucid is stating, the Wunderbox charging system, when coupled with a Level 2 charger, can get a charge rate of up to 19.2 kilowatts even when at home. This can be translated to almost 70 miles of EV range due to just one hour of being charged. This number gets much extended when we used a fast charging DC system. When using a DC fast charger, a charging rate of between 300 to 350 kilowatts can be achieved. That translates into almost 20 miles of charge per minute of charging. This may sound as simply versatile, but is quite strategic as well. Lucid Motors is strategically going towards achieving the best range and performance in its EVs rather than boasting a certain high number of charging stations across an area. The Lucid Air Dream, which has been fully booked presently, can achieve an EPA-verified range of over 503 miles while having a monstrous 1,080 horsepower. Even if we move down the ladder and see the least expensive Lucid Pure variant, it also has an expected range of over 400 miles. Peter Rawlinson has always been an advocate of EV efficiency and has declared it to be the most important thing revolving around not only the Lucid Air, but also other EVs. According to him, this is measured in a metric of miles per kilowatt hour. 
Lucid Motors considers itself to be the market leader in this regard as it has miles per kilowatt hour number of more than 4.5. When looked at from a strategic point of view, this is something very smart as an EV with a large range will be needed to get lesser charged and last long through long road trips. When the time comes to charge the EV, the fast charging infrastructure allows the users to get the most range in the least amount of time. Electrify America Deal Lucid Motors is not just claiming to use this new strategic approach, but has also worked on it practically. A deal has been done between Lucid Motors and Electrify America in which owners of the Lucid Air variants will get to charge their EVs through the expansive charging station network of Electrify America. On top of that, the Lucid Air owners will get to enjoy up to three years of free charging from charging stations owned and set up by Electrifying America. There are endless opportunities here for Lucid Motors, Electrify America, and Lucid owners. Lucid Motors will not have to worry about the capital-intensive process of setting up its network of charging stations across the USA to cater to its large number of customers and focus on the betterment of its vehicle range and performance. Electrify America will not have to worry about the shortage of demand for its charging stations and infrastructure as Lucid owners will always be there to utilize its services. Lastly, the Lucid owners will have the ease of traveling across the USA without the anxiety of being out of the proximity of a charging station as Electrify America has a large network of charging stations. With the help of bi-directional charging, Lucid owners can easily get their EVs charged through a charging station and power their off-the-grid vacation homes as well. Summary Indeed, Lucid Motors does not have the first mover's advantage and it is exclusively reserved with Tesla Motors. However, there is an advantage of all this to Lucid Motors as it does not have to take on the highly capital-intensive task of setting up a network of charging stations just to ensure that customers will not refuse to buy an EV out of the fear of running out of range and being stranded. Lucid Motors can easily partner up with third-party charging station companies like Electrify America and ChargePoint that have their extensive network of charging stations across the United States. This capital is going towards the research and development of better onboard charging infrastructure and charging speed. Lucid Motors believes that the secret to winning this race is an efficient and quick charging EV. If an EV has a large range, it won't be needed to get charged often, and when it does need to be charged, it will be done at very high speeds. The practical implications of this are seen in the supercharging speed of 20 miles per minute for the Lucid Air. Lucid Motors has also entered a deal with Electrify America, which will let Lucid owners use the wide network of charging stations and also get up to three years of free charging. Many thanks if you made it here. What are your thoughts on the fast charging network by Lucid Motors? Will it save money for the EV maker and seller? Mickey stated that Lucid will stand out emphasizing that the company has fantastic vehicles, luxurious design, and a big interest of the Saudis. Do you agree? Let us know your thoughts in the comments down below. Thanks for watching.